Hello guys, who here, back with another video. This time around, we are talking about uh, the update that came to Magic Find with the Delve update of 2020. So uh, we covered, you know, Magic Find on the channel before, actually a few times, but this is an update to what happened with Delve and what changes was to Magic Find in there. So first of all, I wanna shout out Summer Has because this person provided these stats that I'm going to show on the screen uh, very momentarily. And also in the description, you can check out the link to, to all uh, that uh, shenanigans there. There's a lot more uh, besides the Magic Find you can find on that uh, website. So it's definitely uh, worth checking out all of those stats if you're looking for uh, stats. There's also like Chaos Chest uh, updates and, and stuff like that, what's in it and, and whatnot. So it's worth definitely worth checking out uh, that site. It's in, linked in the description. So without further ado, let's jump into what the, the stats are. So uh, on the screen right here, you can see all of the uh, pre-stats, if you can call it like that, um, all the stats on the, uh, I guess it for you would be the left side, <laughs> uh, the left side of the picture. Um, that is what we had before the Delve came out. And PTS means what basically means Delve because those are the numbers they've taken from what happened on the, uh, you know, on the uh, PTS server. And it's also gone into live. So it doesn't really, uh, don't, don't get confused that it says PTS basically. It is what went into the live server. So of course survival, the first one means that that is the magic find you get by defeating uh, things out in the world and you have a personal um, survival. If you die, you lose some magic find. We actually also lose this magic find if you do a slash respawn. We actually lose this magic find as well, but you can gain it again by killing monsters uh, all over the place and anything like that. Just It's not that big of a deal, but I just didn't want to mention that. Uh, next thing is, of course, from dragons. Uh, it also shows with, with patron how much it is. That's, of course, with all dragons that are available in the game right now. Uh, also the dragon batches and I can show you right really quickly uh, right here there is these are the dragon uh, batches this is what they mean you know in here where you have your batches and then under dragon ascension down here uh, these are ones because uh, the old dragons the very first dragons was not tied into dragons uh, now you just get a dragon and you the magic find follows with the dragon but here in this one you uh actually got the dragon and then you got like a batch for all the stats that it did so they tied that all together uh in a later patch so that's the dragon badges the next is of course the fixture and the fixture is um if you can see it on the screen i hope so you can uh but the fixture down here is that uh this one right here gives you the extra magic find and it's not every club that has it uh, our personal community club does not have it because it's very expensive as you can see 1080 club it uh, every single week you have to pay for this one and since our is all uh you know all is uh, like a free one, which you were just getting the one from the traveling merchant. Uh, that's not going to be enough to cover all of this, uh, the cost and, and whatnot. So, uh, but with this magic find, uh, you know, you get that a uh, little bit of extra. So the next thing is, of course, hat, weapon, face, all uh, crystal three uh, on the left side, but crystal four, what the amount is on, uh, you know, uh, with crystal uh, four gear. Uh, so you can see the stats it's 195 right now and it will be 260 when you are of course two pearls on it and all stacked up on the stars and stuff like that as well next thing is a ring of course still a five ring that hasn't changed that's still the same thing uh next thing is the ally uh, the hungry hatchling was the best one and it was kind of tied into uh a login reward and so not a lot of people have it but now it's come back with this ally instead which you can craft in the crafting bench there is next to the public delve portal in the hub so therein you can find in the new i'll make a video talking about all the new allies and stuff like that in a future video where i'll cover all of them but in there you can craft it and you can see the stats of it uh, on this picture i had here next thing is the sun seeker elixir that was part of an event so you're probably not going to uh, have that uh, i have one left after the event and i'm just just saving it because it's i don't know if it's an event that's coming back we haven't seen it for I would say a year and a half or something like that. I think that's how long it's been, but it is something people still have in their, you know, 
maybe in the inventory. So I want to cover that as well as it also is on right here. Next thing is Lucky, Lucky Clovers. Those we actually get back once in a while when we have an event. One of the days is to uh, trigger your magic find and then you get one of these Lucky Clovers. So those is actually something that's coming back. Uh, but the elixirs are, are very not. Then you got the Sunday bonus, of course. Um, you already know it. It's on Sundays. So you get that extra 100 magic find for a non-patron and 400 extra for uh, regular, uh, you know, users. Or uh, par par uh, paragon, sorry, <laughs> patron users. That's what it's called. And yeah, that you can see down the total. And also you can see there's a couple of events that gives you uh, some extra magic find as well. But again, they're also tied into some events. But uh, lastly, that is how much magic find you have. Uh, with all the things here, but I did mention in the beginning that we are also there's some changes to mastery uh, And I want to show you guys that now because if I go into my stats You can see right above the webcam right here. You can see my finger is pointing right here I have 5,333 uh, Magic find at the moment and as you could see with the crystal 4 gear and I just want to mention as well I only have crystal 3 gear um, this is tied into our mastery now. Magic find is basically never ending. Uh, besides it is ending when you get a thousand mastery, <laughs> but we don't have enough stuff for that uh, yet. But the thing is every rank now after level 500, after level 500, it's going to give you one uh, ma uh, magic find per level. So the higher mastery you have now, the more magic find you're also going to have. So I can't calculate uh, this exact number besides I could make some calculations out of saying oh well, you have this much mastery and you have this much and and that's basically how the changes are with the masteries so our mastery is tied into or our magic find is tied into our mastery now so after level 500 trove mastery and not geode mastery it's not your total mastery it's in your trove mastery uh, geode mastery gives something else that is tied into your magic find as well. So the ones I listed on the picture, that is what you can uh, basically do yourself if that makes any sense. And then, of course, mastery is something you also do yourself in a way, but you kind of accumulate that over time. You're not going to go from like level one to 600 in like one day or something like that. So, but you could possibly go from whatever the... Uh, you know, lowest is to uh, the highest on the picture that I, you could post, uh, potentially do that in one day. That's basically what I mean. So um, that was the update to the Magic Find. I don't want to make this video any longer than it already is, but this was an update to all of the previous videos as well. I've mentioned some of the stuff that I already mentioned, but uh, you know, this is an a 2020 update to the magic find so i hope you guys enjoyed it if you did make sure you like and subscribe helps me out very much and super much appreciated and i will just catch you in the next video so take care and i'll see you next one bye